All right, gonna show you something very, very interesting here about the Trinity. All you gotta do is go on Google and search up Christian Trinity. I mean, obviously I use DuckDuckGo, I don't use Google for many reasons, but just search up in your search browser, Christian Trinity, and you know what you'll get? You'll get primarily Roman Catholic sources. Like the top sources are all Roman Catholic. I mean, that one's about the uh, history of the Trinity. Uh, like, all down, see a Catholic, you know, there. Uh, you know, icon of the Holy Trinity, Orthodox icons, because the Orthodox believe in this uh, pagan trinity as well. Uh, you know, more there. Celebrating the most holy trinity. You know, this graven image of this homosexual, sodomite looking Christ guy. You know, doesn't look, I mean, it's not at all what Jesus Christ it looks like. We don't know, we don't know what it looks like. We're not supposed to make any graven images of him. Uh, Catholic News World. I mean, again, it's primarily just Catholic sources, you know, uh, Roman, Romanian, you could just go down, Catholic Living Today, blogspot.com, uh, uh, Christ Church Montreal, real music, Christ Church Cathedral music, you know, Cathedral Catholic, uh, CatholicExchange.com, um, Book of Heaven, probably Catholic. I googled at one point they had a lot of Catholic sources. Uh, the Most Holy Trinity, again, Catholic term. Um, but again, most of these paintings, if they're not from a Catholic source, most of these paintings are Roman Catholic paintings. I mean, that's an Orthodox icon. Um, this is the, uh, the second person of the Trinity. Kind of funny because the phrase person, you know, persons, is not a term that is, refer is referring to God. God always calls himself a person, singular, not persons. You know, like this thing right here, God is not, you know, three divine, you know, three divine persons. Uh, there's no basis for that in scripture. You know, Catholic News World, right there, with this uh, grotesque image of this long-haired sodomite, you know, queer-looking Christ guy, you know, and this guy, I guess, they, guess, he's, guess he's God the Father or something, I don't know. I mean, again, this is graven images. Let me show you. Acts chapter tw uh, 17, verse 29. For us, here it is right here, I'll just highlight it. Um, for, uh, for much as then, or then as we are the offspring of God, we ought not to think that the Godhead is like unto gold or silver or stone or graven by art and man's device. This, These paintings right here are man's device. Graven art. You know, graven images. This is not. This is not um, what God looks like. He, he's not three separate persons. Now, don't get me wrong. There is distinction in the Godhead. I'm not, I'm not denying that. There are verses. I can't think of any off the top of my head, but there are verses where the Godhead, where, where the, th the three parts of the Godhead are separate. You know, the Jesus, the Son of God, can be separate from God the Father. I'm not denying that. But they're not three separate persons, as as these Trinitarians claim. You know. I mean, the phrase persons is not in reference to God. He, he's always referred to as a person singular. It's rather the three parts of the Godhead. But this Trinity is a, is a pagan idol. Now also, I want to show you this. Search up Trinity statue. And look, look what you get right here. There's actually statues of the uh, Trinity. Hmm. And you got these uh, stuff over here too, which, you know. But again, um, graven images. The Trinity is a pagan graven image. Now, if you're warning people about asking, what do you believe on the Godhead? Here's what I believe on the Godhead. There's one God and three parts. Jesus, the Son of God, God the Father, and the Holy Ghost. They're not three separate persons as these Trinitarians claim. They're three separate parts, three in one. So, that's what I believe on the Godhead. But the Trinity is a pagan Catholic idol. It is not. It has no basis in scripture. Let me show you something real quick. I'm gonna go to my word searcher and search up the word tr Trinity. Search for exact phrase and hit enter. Zero, zero verses found, look at that. The Trinity is not in the King James Bible. Let me show you something else. Holy Trinity. Oh, zero verses found. 
Oh boy. How about God the Son? Oop, zero verses found. Hmm. How about God the Holy Spirit? Uh oh, zero verses found. Now, the phrase God the Father is biblical, but God the Son and God the Holy Spirit are not anywhere in the Scripture. Not found in the text of the King James Bible. I'm not sure about these modern Vatican Calvinist, you know, Protestant versions, but the King James Bible, the word Trinity or God the Son or God the Holy Spirit is not are, not, are found nowhere in those pages, in the pages of the King James Bible. The Trinity is a false pagan occult idol. So don't be deceived by this, this uh, Catholic idol. God bless you. Goodbye.